like a madman. Still, I said, Fred, move along. She knew what she was doing wrong. He came to me <laughs> from my bureau like a tiger. He could strike the G. None, and yet we both reached for the gun. Oh, yes, oh, yes, we yes, both, oh, yes, we both, oh, yes, we both reached for the gun, the gun, the gun, the gun. Oh, yes, we both reached for the gun. Understandable, understandable, yes, it's perfectly understandable, comprehensible, comprehensible, not a bit reprehensible, it's only fanciable. Very frightened. All I say is, oh my choo-choo, jump the track, I'd give my life to bring you back. Stay away from jazz and liquor, and the man who play for fun. That's the thought that came upon me when we both reached for the gun. And that was Musical Mornings by Yen Serata. Thank you and good night. Yes, it's perfectly understandable. Sensible, comprehensible, not a bit reprehensible, it's all defensible. Good morning, so we just had coffee at a really nice place. I'll show you a video, it's called the Brother Baba Buddha. It was so nice. What do you reckon, Jens? What do you, what's your feedback on the coffee? Ten star coffee. Ten star coffee. And look how busy it is for like a little local thing. Like a small side alley cafe. So uh, we're going to go buy wicked tickets and maybe find some breakfast because I'm actually hungry. <laughs> oh, look how pretty Melbourne is. Sorry. Oh. Great guys. Hello. It's still beautiful. Stop pretending to be popular. I'm gonna find you, Dr. Jones. Jones calling. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Wake up. Is now. this whole vlog just gonna be continuous in Prada cabarets? What good is sitting alone in your room? <laughs> Come hear the music play. Anyway. Life is a cabaret. The it's been blue skies the blue whole time we were here. Is at me. And now it's for the first time since we've been down here. It's like grey skies are drizzling, but I love this weather still, so can't go wrong. Wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. We're gonna see Wicked. That was beautifully on tune. We're at a photo thing where they're gonna take a photo of the entire cast and crew of cast. Oh no, cast, not crew of the Wicked. Yeah, the entire ensemble and main characters and of Wicked. Ensemble. Wicked. Wicked. Les Miserables, The King and I, and Rocky Horror Show. Like double whammy, Wicked Tonight, Wicked Right Now, Wicked all the time. So excited. So yeah, we're waiting for everyone to turn up. The King and I people are here though. Wicked. Good afternoon everyone, my name is Leah Howard. If I could please have all our spectators and photographers step away from the stairs so we can arrange this photo for the best advantage for us. Thank you very much. Can I find Simon Gleason in the house anywhere? Yes. In the good old Parliament House. Can you please come forward? Can I have all our fantastic crew and musicians? Can you please go behind your show for me? Look at him. Look at him. He's so beautiful. Oh, there she is. The train's so cute.
Everybody, as we're getting close, we'd like to take an official photo. And also, too, I just don't want the occasion to pass without saying thank you to everybody, because ultimately the theatres are... Uh, thank you to everybody, because the theatres are part of this city. They have been for nearly 200 years in some cases. Uh, Jules, are you here, Jules? Wardrobe malfunction. We just got out of... We cut... Ta -da. It was we so cut... cool. We cut... Ta -da. We cut... I don't even have to... You don't even have to be in the musical. You can just watch him. But it was phenomenal. It was so good. So good. Huh? Did you like it? No. <laughs> no. Look, hang on. We'll turn the program we got. Ah! Australian cast is always best. You're <laughs> gonna get a coffee? No, I think I think you should run into that building. Like as in into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> look, it's Big Ben. That's not Big Ben. I'm sure it is. I'm pretty sure I know my landmark. To relax. <laughs> it's not, it was just filming two seconds, like, editing two seconds ago. I'm trying to relax. Obviously, it's not working. Yeah, so, we're gonna go out to a dinner. Um, Grossi. Yeah. Grossi on Florentino or something weird like that. I don't know. It came in the prize thing. So, it's all paid for. I think the meal is worth like $150 with wine. So it's pretty exciting. Um, I'm freaking starving. What did we even eat today? I think we had a coffee and a bread roll. Yes. Sounds like a student budget. <laughs> not even coffee. <laughs> like, that's not in the student budget. Um, no, but yeah, pretty damn excited. Look at Yenzo. Getting... Are you putting two pairs of socks on? Yes. <laughs> Why? So I get blisters and so it's not too cold. <laughs> Do you know how cold it is? Yeah, I've been outside. You're wearing a green shirt. Is it? <laughs> it looks like it in this light. It's blue. It looks like it on this camera. It's the bluest blue I've ever seen. No one mourns the wicked. Yeah, this looks like he should be in wicked. Blue. Do you look fancy yeah. enough? My mum calls this coat the goat coat. <laughs> I, can, I can be like the animal. I can play. That's gonna be my role in. Um, Dr. Dillamont. Yeah, I can be like. That's a bad idea. If that's a... Oh, that's a really bad <laughs> idea. Bad. I'm so glad I have that on camera because I've been asking you to do that for a good, like, six months. And every time you're like, um, no, don't make me sing. I'm going to sit over here with my clans and watch the alley cats from the fire escape. They understand me. Tinkle. Sorry, can we watch? Get away. 
We just want to watch. It's okay. Okay. Just stand here until you go away. <laughs> like a while. Excuse me. Get away, I'm gonna pee. <laughs> Dinner time. And something smells good. What's that off? Maybe I'm just paraphrasing. Okay, can we go in? <laughs>